The first CRISPR-edited babies were born in 2018 as a result of unethical and unjustified science experiments. This is the story of Lulu and Nana. So a Chinese researcher genetically modified germ cells, you know, the egg and sperm that make babies, to break a gene that is required for HIV infection. Pretty simple. Without this gene, HIV can't infect. This work was highly unethical for four major reasons. The study was rampant with technical uncertainties. There was questionable informed consent and the rejected publication lacked key information like the funding sources. However, the scariest issue was that the work was completely unjustified. Here is an excerpt from the method section of that rejected publication. You can see that the father was HIV positive, though he was adherent to anti-HIV therapy and he had undetectable HIV levels in his blood. So though some people think that this study was done to protect the twins from getting HIV from the father, we see later on that it says the male sperm, the father, was washed thoroughly to remove the HIV uh, from the seminal fluid, a standard method. So then why did this scientist create HIV-resistant children? Is it so that one day, maybe, if they have sex with an HIV-positive partner, they won't be able to contract it? So the risk to benefit deduction is completely imbalanced with such a new technology like CRISPR. This researcher was imprisoned, fined, lost his laboratory and career. Now this is just an excerpt of this larger story that is told fully in our CRISPR Foundations course.